And now we go to some uh, breaking news. Eight people have been killed and 16 injured in three bomb explosions in Grozny, the capital of Russia's southern republic of Chechnya. Officials say seven of those who died were police officers. Now a suicide bomber detonated his device as they attempted to arrest him. Well, for more on this breaking news story, we're now joined by correspondent Peter Oliver in Moscow. Uh, Peter, c can you tell us exactly what happened? Well, what we're hearing is that the first bomb explosion that was set off was um, policemen trying to tackle a would-be suicide bomber. He detonated his device while he was being um, while they, while those police officers were trying to take him into custody. Around the same time, a separate device, whether it's a suicide attack or not, we do not know as of yet. A second explosion took place. Um, and then we're hearing of a third explosion elsewhere in the city. So far, we have eight people confirmed as of being killed, as well as at least 16 wounded. This has happened on what is one of the most holiest days in the Islamic calendar, the Chechen Republic, a mostly Islamic, um, well, an Islamic Republic, a predominantly Muslim area of Russia. This is a very, very um, important holiday which was taking place, and the, these bombers have chosen this time to, to carry out this attack. Uh, Ramzan Kadyrov, the president of the Chechen Republic, has condemned these attacks, saying, calling them cowardly, saying that um, they, the, the perpetrators will be found. But as I say, as it appears at the moment, three separate bomb blasts going off across uh, Grozny, the capital of the Chechen Republic. One of them definitely, it seems, a suicide blast um, as a prospective suicide bomber was being taken into custody, detonating his device. A second explosion taking place just next to him and a third explosion occurring elsewhere in the city. Of course, as soon as we find out more about this breaking story, which is just happening as I'm, as I'm explaining it to you, we will bring it to you here on RT. All right. Thanks very much uh, for that update. RT's Peter Oliver there. Of course, we will bring you all the information.